Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Star Maid here on the Star Squadron server. Woohoo! Yay! So, what has been happening? No clue, no idea. All I know is I have time to record, and so time to carry on. So, what are we going to do today? Well, today I figure we're going to create this blueprint and see what happens and see how we can modify it for our dock here then we'll have to of course get rid of our ship so uh, if we go map and then what I want to do is I want to check out uh, was it Curso space which is over here somewhere but I have no clue how the warp gates work oh here we go there's a blue line I see so I see so we would need to go to this station here uh, now I understand what JW was talking about okay okay so basically I would need to take you jump down to here then take the warp gate into here which then I can fly into I think then cursor space if I hold the shift we can move faster I think cursor space is in here somewhere ah oh, here we go planet cursor so I definitely want to take a peek at what all this stuff is there's shops in here there is undiscovered station pirate station beta yeah there's these pirate stations nearby it'd be kind of neat to check it out and and to see what's kind of going on right so without further ado let us yeah let us do that so how are we going to do this today hmm. I don't know man is that a lock oh I see what that is so weird. Uh, is this the one to get out? <laughs> Let me out! Frick's sakes. How about this one? There we go. That works. <laughs> Not sure why the doors aren't functioning as they're supposed to. So I'm just going to do it by hand. Not sure if the logic is broken. <laughs> oh boy. I'm not sure if that has anything to do with the update or it's just me being derpy, but let us enter the ship core. Zed goes into the flight mode. Let's disconnect. Let's change to the camera here. Okay, so now, oh, what's this? What is this? That's a creative way of docking. Hmm. Let's just check this out here. This is probably what, Sven's? Sh uh, ship I think that's Sven's dock that's kind of kind of cool uh, the ships that were here are gone oh no wait they're up here now how are these looking no it looks like they were moved we got the warp gate there so let's fly over in this direction here just for a little bit and let's stop right here okay let's see what happens now so we're going to going to hop out of my spaceship here I'm going to actually pick up all of these pieces so let's actually go into this mode and let us just pick it all up and the reason we're doing this is because we can and I don't need this ship anymore this is the whole the whole purpose of bringing the salvager in is so that way we can do this now then now there's probably a better way of doing this but that's fine I will do it the good old-fashioned way just by just removing the systems even the faction one we don't need that yeah I don't know I could probably do a selection box but I, I've never really kind of bothered to to figure that out I guess if we kind of sat here we could figure that out but I don't know just gonna take away everything and then we're going to spawn in our whole ship and I think I can do that I can destroy it shabam here we go okay so now this is the blueprint oh no, no. <laughs> um, is it left click uh, no okay how about like right click info uh, here we go spawn we go is it Shars runabout or is it DE 
Shars run about. Okay, let's just do that. A valid name. Oh, okay, so this is why we have a certain naming. Shars run about. <laughs> oh my goodness. Shabam! Oh, what's happening? Where's my ship? Where's my ship? Um. <laughs> where? Oh, where? Is that the ship? No. Where? Oh, where did you go, materials? Mm -mm -mm. Now, can we find it on the radar? Let's see here. Shards run about 1.2 kilometers. Where is this? Oh boy, went through way down here. So where is it? Oh man. So I tell you what. <laughs> um, oh man, this is brutal. I didn't know it would do this. I thought it would place it. Oh man, so it must place it in the center of the... Oh man. Um, I need to create a ship. Uh, is that X? Just go droney. Droney. Um, let's enter the ship core. Flight mode. And I think this should still operate under one. Where are we? Yeah, we want to go down here. Yeah, this should still be good. Uh, this would be, be a little bit better. We'll take a look. Yeah, there we go. Let's see if it spawned in correctly. <laughs> Looks like there's a dock on it. Nice. Um, not sure what's on top of that. Oh man, it does not look like the one that I was working on. Oh boy. It's like a non-complete one. Yeah, what's going on on top here? Why is it missing? Oh man, it's missing a whole section of block on top. Uh, the thrusters are looks like they are intact. Let's take a quick peek at that. Oh yeah, look at that. It's so beautiful. At least I think so. And down here, oh, there's some missing blocks here. Oh boy, I wonder what the systems are like inside. And looks like we got all those pieces. Looks like those are okay. We'll have to do a weapons test here and a salvage test. Oh, man, this, is, this thing is awesome. I'm disappointed, though. <laughs> There's some missing pieces. Missing pieces. Oh, man. Okay, let's pop out of this thing. Is it build mode we go into? And this is how we delete it. Okay. Let's go. Let's hop into this bad boy. There's a few ways in. But we'll do the, the obvious way here. Um, yeah, okay. Now, I do want to put in a generator in place. I put in an extra layer of door here. Oh, I thought I had gravity generators in here. But that is fine and dandy. Uh, we go up here. Should be an inventory system in here on either side, which I think there is. Yeah, there is. You can actually set one of these bad boys as, I think, uses personal cargo so now that will be our cargo which is amazing and then we go up here still don't see uh, we have a nice dark area here I was gonna put systems and stuff in here and then up here well, I'm I have a funny feeling this is an older version of my ship hmm we're gonna have to hop in and give it a test flight here just to see how it operates because yeah there's a big issue I have a big issue with this I'm gonna go down into the core room here should be faction signature no owner but I do own this this is my ship <laughs> there are cameras there's a side camera another side camera is this forward yeah, I think this is... Now, there's a couple things going on down here at the bottom. We have, I think, a salvage computer. We have the radar jammer. There is a cloaker, but that does not seem to 
bowed very well. Let's see if we keep the radar jammer off. Can we turn this bad boy back on? Six? No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> the cloaker definitely is no good. No good. We have our warp drive. This is our jump inhibitor that we can activate. And um, this is one of the rail dockers. Yeah, okay. I thought maybe I had some more rail dockers, but I don't. The missile computer, so there is that. And salvage, yeah, okay. So I think we need to do a test. There's no cannons on this ship because I was just building as a missile barge. And yeah, so let's go back into the, the build mode here. Let's kind of do a quick fly through. Uh, these are the corridors. And then in here, scattered throughout, there's systems. There's a little cavity down here I left. I wasn't sure what to fill that up with. And otherwise, snaking through the entire thing is just more and more systems. We got missile systems. There is a small gap for stuff here as well. I was figuring if I needed to build more power units, that kind of stuff, then that's kind of what this is for. Can maybe put more capacitors or shield thingies. I don't know if that was kind of partially what, what the testing was for. And I need to use the shipyard. I need to use the shipyard. There's a ship in the shipyard. <laughs> oh man, so this is why I need my own materials. But the docked entity, there's a docked entity that sits on top of here part of the ship which I'm I'm impressed is actually there or maybe it's this thing there's a, a ship piece that sits on top yeah I think that's the one but man this is this is pissing me off here actually how many other blocks are missing mm. might have to buy a bunch of blocks and fix this up before we can actually go out into combat the thing should have shields how can I look at that? Go back into flight mode. Yeah, you see that there's 5.1 power. Shields is only 297,000, man. I don't even know if that's enough. I might have to end up adding more uh, capacitors. That's a funny suspicion I have. I wonder, yeah. I'm, I'm wondering if this ship is complete. Yeah, okay. Well, anyways. So now on to the fun stuff here. We're already, ooh. Why is there only the one? What's going on here? What side of the ship is this? Is this the front side of the ship? Ah, uh, here we go. This is the front side of the ship. So maybe I was on the side. I don't know. I have so many different cameras on the ship. It's been a while. So let's kind of do. Let's do a quick jaunt with this ship. I double clicked, but it must have went on the planets do that plot path to current I'm surprised the jump drive is actually fully charged because <laughs> that's how it was when I blueprinted it so let's see here so let's jump drive there and we'll buy some blocks let's see here let's right click let's see what happens shabam it's teleporting Woo! And see with this we can continue charging though. So that's not an, an issue. Let's kind of move closer to this. This thing does have a little bit of a handling. It does have a, a slow rate of turning, but it does move quite quickly. Right? I think it will move at a decent pace for the size of the ship that it is and whatnot. Okay, so we need to buy some advanced armor, uh, some advanced hull. The black hull, black advanced armor. We need to buy what, uh, 500? Maybe. That sounds about right. If I go Z, right here, we want to make sure that we have blocks here. See, I also figured out that this is how you turn the blocks into whatever. These things. It's the mouse wheel. Silly me. <laughs> um, I should turn on. I should turn on this thing. What was it? Maybe I was going to build something else back here. I don't remember what it was, but I, th I could have sworn I had my ship all done. If I if I look back at my footage, I'm I'm thinking I'll be able to see that. But 
Yeah, so let's let's patch this up. So what are we going to do? Well, I need to turn on. Um, I don't know which plane is what, so I have to click on them to see. <laughs> and then we're going to put it right here. And that should allow us to complete this stuff a lot quicker. And I know you can kind of do settings with this. So, for example, if we go into advanced build mode, I think it's this is the Y. Well, y would be the height, so it would be the Z. And we can do kind of like 10. And just like this. Do, do, do. And I think even like that. Right, and then we can just do do do. Let's just fill these in, all right? Because what we need to do is protect our ship here. This is where I would add like more things is to the back here, maybe. Ah, oh, this just this stinks that I have to do this. I I don't remember the blueprint, you know, what I named it anyways when I was done with it. So, and what did I put on here? You think they got rid of... Oh, no, no, no. That's still like that. Okay. Let's do this. Let's put these here like so. And I think that about covers it. I have a funny feeling there should be angle blocks going along here. Because see these ones here? It's almost like that this stuff is not done. I wonder if I wasn't done. Hmm interesting so let's make sure we do that and we'll just kind of do the same kind of thing maybe i'm just kind of seeing how far so maybe one more right like that like that that makes sense it's one more in but i think because that engine is bigger so i think that is all right yeah, and see, even up here, you can kind of see we need to do here and here. And then that means we can carry on with a bunch more like that. And then we can do this, we can do this. And actually, what this can be, can be one of these pieces. Let's get rid of the, <laughs> the shape. I can't see what this looks like do that I think that will tie that up together nicely and I don't think I have anything going down here I think that is fine and dandy and so this will be like this and I think that's it I think now now the ship I think is completed let's kind of do a quick scan I don't know if I'm going to take these top things off I don't know if I like it. I just did it for show to see what it would look like. We have a dock back there. We have side docks. Oh man, we do have a door back here, but I don't know if I could create a back dock. We'll have to see how that goes. I'm gonna have to change the orientation. Oh, look at that. Look what I see right down here. What was I doing down here? That, oh man, it looks all broken. All right, look at this. This part's all complete. Not sure what was going on down there, but I think that was something similar. Yeah, man. Let's let's reposition this in a different way. Where is the sun? It's there. So let's go up. I think about there. And now we hop out. Let's see. Ah, here we go. Okay, so this side, see this funkiness down here? See how this angled stuff is coming in? And it's kind of creating it tight back here. And it's all kind of meshing into there nicely. I think I have to add another block right up here. Like so, I think. Let's see here. What does that look like? So there's something like that. I don't know. But if I go to this side, see, you have this this mass. What's this mass doing here? So we have the this stuff. 
What's this stuff here, though? Is that, like, extra stuff I was building on? See, I don't have it on this side here. It's like I was building extra pieces or something here. See what happens if we remove these pieces. What does the other side look like? No, I don't think there is anything being removed. So this is extra stuff. From what, I'm not too sure. But let's see now what we are working with. Okay. So it looks like we need to create these diagonal pieces. So it looks like the blueprint didn't come over 100%. But it's close enough. Uh, let's see. Do I do one of these corner pieces? Yeah, I think that's what we do. One of those corner pieces. And then on this side here, we should be able to continue. I think we do the, di the diagonal piece. This piece. So let's make sure we got that going the right way. Let's see. Let's do that. Oh, okay, cool. And let's fill in the rest of these. And I think that is probably it. Yeah, okay, sweet. So we have that. So that is all covered. I think we're good now. That's so weird. So weird I had to do that, but that's okay. Okay, excellent. So now let's see what kind of trouble we can get into. We need something to practice on, to test on. We do need to recharge our jump drive. So let's go, where's the staging? Squadron station, uh, where we go, this is how we do it. We need to go over here, and then there's this one. Oh, come on. It's so brutal. Right here. We need to go to Squad Gate Curso. Plot path to current. Oh, this is exciting. It's exciting. Now, does it go into the staging area at Curso? I think it does. Why can I not see the the jump gate? Am I kind of misaligned? Ah, here we go. I'm misaligned. Oh boy, so this is the one that goes into, looks like our space over there. Okay, hmm. Man, no man. And if I don't survive, I don't survive. It's just the way it's going to be. This is kind of testing this out. And we're going to see what happens when we die. We'll probably dump all our stuff out. It's the usual. It's the usual. It's just fine. Uh, I'll be able to... You know, I'll probably lose 10% of my cash, which is not a big deal. We can just use the Star Squadron factory. So let's do a warp. Um, it might be a couple warps that we have to... Oh, man. What's this stuff? Squad gate. Oh, are we, are we coming upon it? Looks like we're here. <laughs> no, I don't want to jump. Need to recharge. Let's see what this... What the gate looks like over here. No, what's down here? It's this ironclad Mark III Jackson. Huh. That's interesting. What's what's all this stuff? Ironclad. So are these like oh, you know, JW. So this looks like protection stuff. Let's go check it out here. Let's see what this wonderful world of stuff has hopefully my ship will fit through the squad gate uh, it looks kind of small <laughs> it looks kind of small oh snap i'm gonna crash i'm gonna crash or no i'm just i'm just not facing the right way oh, okay so if we do this let's kind of rotate back a bit go up and now let's check a, let's check out what this stuff looks like here looks like we got some ships and some craft we have a little tiny ship that jw has let's kind of encroach on these ships here that looks like that's uh, actually just a regular ship dock thingy uh, what's this stuff here we have a beautiful craft here looks like i wonder what kind of craft this is or is this a station i don't know Looks like this is a big cannon on the one side of it. 
or big thruster if that's the back of it and then up here what's this stuff this looks like an old time yeah it looks like an ironclad <laughs> old time ship that's hilarious huh man the creativity the creativity i tell you okay so now where's the gate here we go hello gate let's see what's going on with this <clears throat> let's see oh almost ran into you sorry let's let's kind of see where we're going to go hopefully let's let's line up uh, let's see here. i'm going to try and line up with the the target plot path to current because i want to face in the direction that it's going to be in so i want to make sure i jump through the warp gate the correct way let's see here the turning around is not the greatest on this ship i have to admit so hopefully the <laughs> hopefully everything survives transit <laughs> oh man this is gonna be interesting okay so i don't have cloaker all i have is radar jammer uh, we do have the missile, you know, like a missile launcher type of setup. So we'll have that. We'll have that ready to go. Oh, it's terrifying. Okay, here we go. Into the warp gate we go. Man, this is, these are pretty small warp gates. Sure. Do I have to do anything? Ah, here we go. Shabam, okay. Let's see what we got going on. Let's see what we got going on. Okay, so far so good. What's over here? Uh, looks like a bunch of craft. 608, so, so it must be what? JW 608's craft? Okay. So, okay, sweet. So, where are we now? So what's all nearby here? The warp gate. Oh, this feels scary to have to die, but I have to lose my craft. Okay, so now we're down here. Now Curso is this way, right? All the way across. Ah, oh, here we go. Now why is the shop red? <laughs> I don't know where I want to jump to. I want to let's jump to here. <laughs> oh boy okay so is that the radar jammer energy i think that says minus up there i hope so hope so okay so if that's the way we need to go well let's do this shabam so 184 left yeah okay that's all right 90 let's recharge i don't know i don't know folks Hopefully I have enough shield rechargers, otherwise we're going to have to rebuild this design. We'll have to pick a different blueprint, because I don't know if this is the correct blueprint. This might have been the one just before I finished with the design, before leaving you know, the other server, the other Star Squadron server. But I'm just recharging the jump drive here, and we're going to do a quick jump just to see what happens. Hopefully you're all enjoying the footage so far. <laughs> enjoying me bumbling around through this. You're mumbling and talking about whatever. You're breathing into the mic. <laughs> oh boy. That's so funny. Oh man. Oh man. System is owned by the lost, which is neutral to you. That is fascinating. Okay, so. We are in deep space here. Let's go into our navigation here. See some asteroids. Okay. Um, do we have a scanner on this ship? Ooh, do we have a... I don't remember. We use? Uh, no, maybe not. I'll have to install a scanner. That will definitely... I don't affect... Hmm. I wonder what that's for. Okay. Well... So, since this is a good spot to do this, we will, I will plot the path to here, so that way if we need to come back, well, I don't know, wait, dang it, okay, 
Hmm. There's a shop here. There's Planet Curso. We should be able to find Planet Curso through you know, looking at space here. So let's do a quick kind of survey. Um, so if, 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 if behind us, yeah, we might have to actually do another jump. Not too sure. Well, you know what? Let's plot path to current. Let's just go to that shop to heck with it. It's red for some reason, and that is fine and dandy. Uh, here we go, here we go. Maybe what we'll do is we'll point in the general direction of the shop. So planet, the planet should be around here somewhere. Then you should be able to see it in space. But anyways, okay. I'm kind of worried, so let's let's charge up the jump drive in case we have to do a quick getaway. And we'll just you know, jump it. We won't you really care where we're going and what destination we're going to and yeah I won't lose much what does it matter it's a game right so we gotta test stuff out and I don't want to hang around Curso too much but okay so let's do this so uh, I guess I could jump in ah whatever jump in jump in oh oh oh, oh snap let's see if we see everything light up we'll know what's going on I see red targets. Um, oh man, let's see where are we? Where are we? Where are we? Uh, Saber, Armada. Um, Paisley class frigate. Ah, okay. Well, we need to kind of keep going. Let's check. Let's take this guy out. Woo! Okay, arming weapons. Oh, and something's firing. I did not choose to fire that. Going too fast. Let's do this. Let's go five. Let's fire. Where are they going? I have it uh, trained on him. Where are they going? What's this? That's a rock. Not sure how these weapons used to work. I thought it would just be a matter of firing off a few rounds and but they're going where are they going where are the missiles flying to are they even hitting his ship what the heck um, let's watch the damage structural integrity is 88 percent that is not what we're firing at. That's just a broken thing. <laughs> what? So if this is loading up, so this should... Where is it going? Okay, well, let's find us a different target. What's this? That's a shop. Rising Tider. Hmm. Now let's do this not sure what's happening not sure what's going on with the missiles looks like the rising tider is taking damage maybe that's from me oops <laughs> oh man let's check this one out otherwise where are we we're still we're we're hanging around curso oh no 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 oh snap where do we jump to where did we jump to no 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 Oh man, oh man. <laughs> uh, I have no idea who ships are who. All I know is the red ships are targets. <laughs> uh, snap. Yeah, look, this would be interesting what kind of interaction. I'll probably finish the episode around here somewhere. I'm probably going to jump out. Uh, <laughs> nothing much. <laughs> oh boy. Going to jump. See what's over here. It looks like there is ships, but what's going on here? Oh, Armada. Oh, what's this purple thing up here? Paracurso neutral. Lost. Huh. Okay, not sure what a scan does for you, but sure. Nah, <laughs> guess we see Surge. 
So let's see here what we got. We got a red ship up here. <laughs> oh, snap. <laughs> let's go take a look at the oppressor. <laughs> at least we can warp out if we absolutely have to. See what this guy looks like up close. Give him a good, nice flyby here. Ooh. Hmm. <laughs> This is cool, actually. Yeah, look at this guy. Look at this ship. Huh. Hmm. The huge ship here. Looks like. Well, oh, look, look at this ship. This is amazing. Wow. So cool, man. Look at that. There's turrets on it. And it's a big, huge thing on the front of it. Wow. And just the every, just the angled. Huh. And just how the little shapes are. Yeah. Amazing stuff, man. Definitely visit Serge's channel. <laughs> I think he's in the list of the Star Squadron. Um, you people, I think. I think. I'm not too sure, though. And it's like there's there's some stuff over here. Yeah, you look forward to seeing your bid. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> It'll be all right. It'll be all right. Junk it left behind of Armada's fleet. Ah, so that's... Uh, cool. Okay, well, yeah. So thank you, Serge. Thanks you for this little bit. Thank you, folks. I'm just going to head back to Star Squad space. But, yeah, but thanks for for watching and I will definitely have to <laughs> I will definitely have to check this out yeah um, I'll definitely have to to check this area out another time um, but I don't know what he's talking about but anyways folks thank you everybody for watching and yeah I'm gonna leave it here I'll see you in the next one bye bye Okay, I think I am going to append this on, so you're obviously going to see this part. So I'm just returning back to Star Squadron space here. And I think we need to figure out... Ooh, <laughs> don't need no missiles, don't need no missiles. So we need to figure out how I can dock into my dock. We have a little bit of a crowding issue here. Yeah. So... We're gonna have to fix something on our ship here. I might have to change the way this dock sits so it sits up and down. So how are we gonna do that? Well, first things first, we're going to turn off that. And it looks like I have a message as well. I just returned from Curso space, had a very interesting interaction. And so yeah, so let's, so this has to be up and down. So which means, that let's take that block out that block out and then let's put um let's see eight let's move this block around i'm gonna try and realign this block um so it has to face to the right so i think to the inside and then this is going to be just the regular rail where's the rail right here it's going to be the typical rail going the other direction, like so. Okay, 
Perfect. And then we want to go. I think this is the camera that we want. Okay, so can we turn the ship to the left? No, we can't. Why not? Okay, um, let's go. Which one's in the front? This one's in the front. So if we go like this, let's see sideways, see if we can kind of eyeball this like this. Okay, I'm gonna go up like that, <laughs> like that. Oh man, this is crazy. Oh, do, 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 do. oh man. Zoom in here. Want to change. Let's see, is this. Okay, yes. Okay, here we go, here we go. So now. Now we need to. Let's see, let's fire some. Excuse me, some beams here. I wish you could. You pick which docker. Uh, we have this one and we have this one. So we have number two and uh, number four. <laughs> number nine. Okay, that's the bottom. Four. Let's give number four a shot and see what happens. Where's the dock though? I don't see a dock on here. Uh, cannot dock structure doesn't fit. Okay, maybe this one. Three, two. Oh snap! Oh no! How did this? How did this dock? How did this dock? Let's hop out. Oh man. Um. Okay, I docked to one of the sides. Let's see if it's this side. Come on. Oh, it's probably doing an autosave. I noticed that the connection problems happen during the autosaves. No, that's not that direction. Let's go the other side. It's obviously th uh, this side here. Shabam. Okay, and then we got this side. Oh, yeah. Snap. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. At least this works. I don't know about the dock. Oh, come on, man. It's broken, so I'm going to do it by hand. <laughs> there we go. Control my own docks and align to this surface. And here we go, folks. There we go. So let's open up the message. I don't know why I have messages, but let's check it out. F4. Oh, what is this? Corrupt. Help corrupt. Interesting. Huh. Well, definitely this is something we'll have to give to to greetings and salut salutations, looks like. Interesting, interesting. But then, I don't know. Hmm. Definitely very interesting information. So, emblazon this. And yeah, and I'll see you all in the, in the next one. I wonder... You definitely check out uh, Surge's channel and definitely, yeah, you definitely follow up on the Star Squadron guys and, and everyone else who's on the server here. Check out all their channels to catch up and I think I might have to do the same. So I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.